Palpate the abdomen, beginning gently and saving painful areas for last. With your fingers together, place your hand flat on the abdomen and press, using a light dipping motion. Moving smoothly, feel in all quadrants, identifying any tenderness or increased resistance to your hand. Now, if you could, try to relax your abdomen a little bit more. Let it go real soft. When resistance is present, try to relax the patient and palpate gently again. Just let me know if anything's uncomfortable. Then, palpate more deeply in all four quadrants as you feel for any masses or tenderness. One hand on top of the other may make it easier to feel deeply. If you feel a structure that suggests a segment of colon, roll it under your fingers in one direction, then another, and try to assess its shape. Here, the sigmoid colon is palpable. Abdominal pain, tenderness, and involuntary muscular rigidity suggests peritoneal irritation. I'd like you to try to cough and tell me where it hurts when you cough. Okay. <coughs> to localize it, ask the patient to cough right and then show you where it hurts. Right, I'm gonna try to then try, try to localize the tenderness with one There's finger. Right, about there. right there. If necessary, feel for rebound tenderness. Now I'm going to push down here and I'm going to let go very quickly. And I want you to tell me whether it hurts more when I push down or when I let go. Okay. Press your fingers in firmly and slowly then quickly withdraw them. Watch and listen for signs of pain. It hurts more when you push down. Unlike in this patient, pain induced or worsened by withdrawal is rebound tenderness and suggests peritoneal inflammation.